Great Day Live on WHS 11 is sponsored by Louisville Cyberknife, a service of James Graham Brown Cancer Center. It is pretty amazing how far we've progressed in just the last 20 years. That includes in how we treat cancer. A cancer diagnosis used to mean weeks and months of harsh treatments that left you weak and very sick. Dr. Xiao Wu is medical director at Louisville Cyberknife and also president-elect of the MD Anderson Radiation Oncology Gilbert H. Fletcher Society. So adding another title, more accolades to your name. Congratulations on that honor. Thank you very much. Will that mean more duties and responsibilities for you? Uh, <laughs> a little bit. You know, Gilbert Fletcher was, in fact, one of the grandfathers of radiation oncology in this country. He, um, he was uh, the second physician at MD Anderson, was chairman of radiation oncology for years. Now he passed away in, uh, in the early 90s, but he trained people all over the world. So his trainees formed a society many decades ago. Mm -hmm. uh, the purpose was to, uh, every year we'll go back to Anderson to receive instruction and wisdom from um, Dr. Fletcher. But of course, after his uh, his his uh, death, the the uh, society uh, goes on, and uh, we have annual meetings and exchange information, and people from all over. Uh, I mean, the meeting could be at Houston or anywhere else. So I'm happy and honored that 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 make me the president elect. So I will be president next year after the meeting. And then I, my major duty is to organize the meeting for 2015. Oh my, that will yes. be a huge task. That will so, be a huge task. So that knowledge and that information you're able to bring home here to Louisville, yes. bringing even more of that to the table. Yes. So let's talk about Louisville Cyberknife because this is pretty remarkable treatment and it is changing people's lives. It is saving lives. Do you mm -hmm. want to talk about how this works, how this technology It is a patients? very interesting radiation uh, technology because it, it is essentially a robot. Mm -hmm and a robot with an arm uh, that moves the radiation machine uh, around the patient, seeking the right spot to hit the tumor. Very precise. Very precise, because in addition, in the room, there are all these devices that actually will tell us where the tumor is. And so the, the uh, system, uh, once we know where it is, the robot will, will go there. So uh, it is continuing tracking and especially for moving uh, tumor and the, uh, the robot shoots the radiation there. So it's very, very uh, precise. And you say a moving tumor, which if you have lung cancer, you have tumors on the lung, obviously your lungs are moving mm -hmm. as you breathe. And so that's mm -hmm. why this is very good treatment for somebody that does have lung tumors. Correct. Because it, you could precisely follow it and hit it without hitting a lot of Normal healthy lung, tissue healthy that tissue, you don't right. want to destroy. Correct. Right. So what other parts of the body? So the lung cancer it treats, and then there are other cancers that it's good for as well. Yeah, we, we can treat brain tumors, certain spine tumors, liver tumors, pancreas, and prostate right now. And maybe a few miscellaneous depends on the, on the situation. Now for lung cancer, maybe uh, it's worth uh, a couple more words. For early stage lung cancer, early stage lung cancer is curable in almost, is about 70% of the time. But traditionally, until about maybe 10 or, or so years ago, that cure, curative treatment is surgery. And surgeon has to remove either a lobe of the lung or the entire lung, depends on where the cancer is. Now, many people with lung cancer have bad lungs, you know, they smoke. Mm -hmm. And so surgery may not be safe or suitable. So now, with modern radiation technology, for generally three to five treatment in, in early lung cancer patients, we could achieve a similar result as surgery. So now, uh, patient w in whom the lung function is borderline and not so good, uh, they have a choice. So they, they may not have to go through uh, heavy duty surgery, they can be treated very easily as outpatient with, with radiation and CyberKnife is one of the very good instruments for it. One of the many benefits and advantages of CyberKnife and then also right. we have more people dying of lung cancer in Kentucky so this is wonderful to have yes. here. Thank you so much Dr. Wu for being here. We My pleasure. It very My pleasure. Much. Level pleasure. CyberKnife is at James Graham Brown Cancer Center and for more information you can call 217-8200. You can also visit LouisvilleCK.com. Thank you.